with the cameras. Come along, sit down, enjoy yourself, put your feet up, relax, go for a hike. Good old farmland out in western Massachusetts. What you smelling, Julie? What are you smelling? So you know you're out in Western Mass when you get that nice farm manure smell. Stewart. Smells like, like Bigfoots. It smells like Stewart. Right. Um, something that sort of always was wafting in the air around Amherst, where Ash and I both went to school. I'm eating cheese it. We absolutely love that part of the state. We love taking the kids out there every fall. And we brought Bubba with us, our little four legged hiking champ. Don't go wearing his Tom Brady shirt. Yeah. We only charge folks to drive up to the top. Oh, All right, so you guys much. parking out here, you're doing it right, you got it. Yeah, you guys we're... gonna take the road or are you thinking about taking a trip? Trail. We can take a trail. We've done it before, but it's been like two or three years. All right, yeah. Um, it's probably love these the friendly uh, trail guys. Yellow on this side of the road, right behind this uh, sign here. Mm -hmm. You guys are gonna go in yellow, which is the TF, the Two Forest Trail. Okay. Okay, and that goes for about a half a mile until 135. That's a marker oh, in the I'm tree. I remember this now. And yeah. that's the Big Devil's Football. And then from there, it changes to blue. You're still on the side of the road, and you're gonna take blue across the road, up another staircase, and right up to the tops. This is just a cute shot of um, Julian Hanner trying to catch some leaves while we're talking to the friendly ranger guy. So we did this hike on Mount Holyoke, which is in Skinner State Park, uh, right near the towns of South Adley and Amherst, kind of close to Northampton as well. We did it, I think, three years ago, so probably 2014, right after we first got Bubba. I think we got him in September when he was five years old, a retired show dog. He looked the best he ever looked probably the day we got him. I think his show dog quality really took a sharp nosedive once he joined, joined the Shake Land. Some pretty tree shots right there that Julie was filming. I love these straight up points of view. But yes, we did this hike three years ago. Um, Bubba was able to do it. Mount Holyoke is, according to Wikipedia, 930, 935 feet tall. So I don't know when a hill becomes a mountain, but to call this a mountain is a little bit of a stretch. But it's a nice little climb. I brought the Canon 7D DSLR with me, as well as the GoPro and the gimbal. So you're seeing both of those kind of camera filming camera shots. It's kind of interesting to me watching this, looking at the difference in quality between yeah, you can find that. the DSLR and the GoPro. We're looking at the GoPro right there. And coming up, you will see the DSLR quality. Good sized tree that came down there, obviously. Oh, that's a. Mm, I think that is the. Oh, here we go. DSLR here. But not always super obvious. Shows you how nice the GoPro is. That is definitely 7D. See those details and the nice bark on the tree. The boy having some fun. Back to our GoPro and the gimbal. And there's me. Hey, Bubba, be quiet. I'm doing commentary. Oh, that's funny. He sees himself. I know. You see yourself, Bubba. I know. It's exciting. Bubba's barking. Bubby, what are you barking at? Yourself? Yeah, All right, calm down, Bubby. I, I got to do this for YouTube. Ah! Bubba, Bubba, stop. You're embarrassing me. I have to do this for YouTube. Oh, do you want to sit with me while I do the commentary? All right, hold on. Okay. All right, Bubba wanted to be in the shot. He's wearing his nice fall Halloween sweater. It was Halloween a few days ago, as of the time of editing this. Okay, so that... The ranger guy, I believe, referred to that rock as Devil's Football. I think that's what he said. I have to go back to the beginning there. Very cool rock. Kind of hard to imagine how that thing just ended up there. I'm already giving Bubba a little bit of a break. Steeper than I remembered. We did this about... You've been holding him more than he's been walking. We climbed this three years ago when we just got Bubba when he was five. He did great. He's a little older, a little wiser. Hitching a ride for the time being. Dad, can I hold him? Sure. You got him? There's Bubby. Do I look like Dr. Evil with Bubba a little bit? Less bald. 
Bubba could be. Bubba has been confused for a cat before. Your mouse. I know it's embarrassing. But looking good in his Tom Brady shirt. Spry, he just turned nine. Look at him move. It was actually really hot and humid. That's why we're hydrating Bubba right here. But it was um, about 80 degrees with super high humidity this day, October 7th. And um, kind of weird how hot and humid it's been this whole fall, actually. Even today, it's like 72 degrees in November now. 80 degrees and humid. October 7th. Feels like July. So this is the portion of Mount Holyoke hike where getting a little bit steeper. Didn't hold back Bubba. This is where I have the gimbal. I was actually shooting this inverted so I had to flip it in post-production, but it has this mode where you can hold the gimbal really low to the ground, which is kind of nice for these kind of shots. And um, perfect for doggy cam. Nice little drop off to our left here. It's always kind of fun when you're hiking when you have these kind of steep drops to the side of the trail. Probably expertly navigate this treacherous drop off. Look at them easily. Drop off, no problem. Walking along this ridge line here to this huge, massive drop. Huge. The woods. Huge. And Bubba just expertly walking the edge. Mount Holyoke's not all that steep. I think it's a little less than a thousand feet. Yet, 80 degrees and super humid makes this kind of a harder climb in some ways than Manadna. I think we're all pretty hot and tired, even though it's early on. So I think we were actually further than I was thinking there um, in terms of getting to the summit. Um, just a leaf. At only 935 feet, when I was saying that, we were probably at 700 feet or something. We had done quite a lot of the climb. I'm not sure which way the trail goes. We love this trip. We've been doing it every year for a while now. And uh, check out this drop off. Kind of cool. I got some nice sweat going on my shirt there. When we get to the top, Oh, I got a duck under this bridge. A stick, no problem. So this was awkward. <laughs> Tight quarters here. <laughs> hey, how you doing? We thought we Which were way, taking the trail to the top. Oh, we're underneath, huh? Oh. Dead end. It was to the right back there. Girl just chilling by herself. Go back that way, Ash. Oh, okay. Is that right? A little oh, yeah. detour? Yep. Oh, that humidity. So that little dead end was right below where a whole bunch of people are hanging out at the top of this summit view. So we just had a little detour there. We came out right underneath the prospect house, which is this old cool hotel at the top of this Mount Holyoke, built in 1851. And uh, yeah, we took a little wrong turn, but we'll be up at the top of the house shortly. Been hiking for about 50 minutes. And looks like it's just over a mile to get to the top. Nice job, Holyoke, buddy. great hike for a family, great for a dog, obviously, here. the fact that Bubba can do it. Sorry, Bubba. Hi, the tiger. But at 9.35 feet, you know, it took us less than an hour to get to the top and the foliage was pretty nice that day. So if you find yourself in Western Mass, give Mount Holyoke a try. Very beginner level, I would say. And we're at the top, just like that. Very cool view from the summit house here. You can see the Connecticut River. You can see Northampton. You can probably see all the way out further towards New York. Yeah, it's a small view. That's not good. That's not a big deal. Must be a big This guy was funny. Kind of big dude, with the tattoo, and man, he was in love with Bubba. <laughs>
I have a picture on my desk at work of the first trip we did with Bubba with the kids where we did a family selfie and oh, I just love that photo. Kai's got a UMass hat on and one of my all time favorite family pics. You guys getting some raindrops? There's the girls having some fun in a quick little rain shower. Again, almost like a summer rain shower where <laughs> yes, it's a blast exactly of rain. <laughs> and then hey, hey, Kai and Julie hey, trying to do their car wheels, I think. <laughs> We're gonna go to Taco the Summit House just to check out the house and the porch and yeah, see how are. that looks. Yeah, yeah we are. So Kai and Ashley and Bubba had started down the road toward the base. And the girls and I thought it'd be fun to show you guys. We did this for you. We thought it'd be fun to show you guys what the top of the Summit House looks like. Last time wasn't there these things that you could look out? Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, go right here, I'm trying to get a shot of you guys. The background is awesome. Look at that She never, no two boats. Oh, down the Connecticut River, yeah, cool. Connecticut River? Daddy, I'm going to do an interview with you. You're going to do an interview with me? Yes. But Daddy's filming you. I'm filming you. All right, I'm going to film you doing an interview with me, okay? How about that? Okay. Okay, let's do an interview. No, you have to talk to your channel, actually. You I have to talk to all my 13 subscribers? Uh, Hannah, Hannah, move. So I had 13 on October 7th. Now I'm cruising towards 70. Progress. Okay. Dad's going to put that in his video. Okay. Okay. You look All right. very weird. Okay. You do not look weird. You look amazing. No, I can't. Okay, you're a little close, I think, for my 13th subscriber. So 70 and GoPro in action here. Using the audio, I think, from the 7D. Even without a mic was actually better than the GoPro. Talk about it. Talk about what? Your channel is being up here with such an amazing view. I'm going to do it. So the Mount Holyoke hike for me, Julie, was a life-changing experience. Jokes. It was a little higher, there you go, perfect. It was, um, it was a little sweat, a lot of humidity. Bubba is the reason that I kept climbing. When I Jokes. I make it all 831 feet or whatever all this to top of this. I love it out here. Beautiful. I'm not focusing. Smell of manure. Comedy. <laughs> this inner ring is the focus. Which one? All right, let me interview you. This? Okay. Now this just zooms in So, now. Julie, what would you like to tell all 13 people watching? Oh, I want to tell them how amazing it is. So, yeah. yeah? How do you think Bubba did climbing today? Speaking of Bubba, you think we should go catch up with yeah, Mom and focusing Kai the camera. And Bubba? Okay, I'm filming. Oh, I never stopped Strava. If I ever pass out on a hike, make sure you stop my Strava. Let's go catch Kai, Bubba, and Mama. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So this is probably a little ill-advised, kind of in hindsight, but man, it was fun at the time. Yeah, it's Running is fun. It's <laughs> hard. Running with cameras, even more fun. Maybe dangerous. It was fun. Flying. Look at that form. Love it. Definitely should be on the right side of the road. Go to the right side of the road, girls. Go to the right side. Go to the right side. <laughs> Love that smile. You girls are flying. That's Holyoke. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you to all 66 subscribers now. If you enjoy hiking, running, want some inspiration to be active outdoors, subscribe, tell your friends. Thanks, guys. Bye, Bubba, Bubba. say goodbye. Bubba says bye.